Namaskar. As part of the Bihu festival, we call it Bihu in Assam, but in different parts of India, it's called in different names, like Pongal in Tamil Nadu, Andhra and Karnataka, it is called Makar Sankranti, and in North part, it is called Bishu or Lori. So we celebrate this particular festival as part of the harvesting time. So after harvesting, the farmers bring the, all the grains and all the uh, food, food stuff in the home. So during our childhood, what we do? We, after school, we go to the peri field and the remaining part of the straw, we cut it at the root and we bring it home and collect it in, in, in a bunch. And we preserve inside the home. And uh, it does, this process happens with, uh, almost for a month before Bihu and uh, throughout that month. At the end, for one, one week, we, we create a beautiful home out of that. It's a hut, it's a straw hut with uh, raw bamboo and these straws. And there's a lot of fun involved. And just prior to one week, the Bihu Ghar will be ready. And we celebrate every evening inside that. We make a lot of food items and eat, and we respect our elders. And, uh, and at, at the next day, the first day of Bihu, the Mag Bihu, uh, that is we call first uh, calendar day of Mag. That day we burn the Bihu Ghar. Okay. So uh, after burning, we worship Lord Agni, Agni Devta. This Bihu is uh, widely celebrated in Assam and Northeast side. And as I said, Pongal and Makar Sankranti in South, Southern India. And this festival brings a lot of prosperity, a lot of happiness, and we show our gratitude to Agni Devata and the, uh, all, the, all the elders for all the prosperity we have, all the blessings we have. And this is what I want to share in this video. And here in Bangalore, we have celebrated with the help of this uh, beautiful community as part of New World in Kasavana Hali, Bangalore. And they have done a great work over here. You can see the unity of the people. And we have celebrated yesterday Uruta. And today, we all came together. This is also called uh, Meiji, instead of Bihuhar also. We burn it and we uh, worship it. So this is what we did. <coughs> See, this is the significance of the Bihu festival. And this is Meiji, as I said. And these are the Assamese cakes. Tilpita, Laru, all this. <laughs> so, and this is uh, this script is written in Assamese. This is portraying the Assamese culture basically as part of Bihu. And I am so glad to share this very precious moment and the traditions of Assamese culture. As part of Bihu festival, we celebrate lot of activities like egg fight or coney juice, and also we perform Bihu activities, Bihu dance, and you'll be able to witness and enjoy this moment with us very beautiful bihu dance stay tuned towards the end of this video so you can see here as part of the bihu tradition this is called kone juice or egg fight so whoever wins the first round he will he can play with the second person the previous winner is going to fight with the next contestant yeah lucky fukon aroe nilam two contestants here is Nilam is going to contest with Lucky. Oh. 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 So, Nilam is still the winner. Stop it! Nilam is still the winner. He has like his more experience. You can make omelet, omelet directly. No, Nam to give us a Nam did.
Well played by Tinian. Tinian is still the winner. No? Tinian versus another contestant. Come. Ah. Do not do it. Do it. Do it. Do She is winning 10 times. Oh. Oh. Thank you so much for listening and I wish you have a happy Bihu and wonderful day ahead. Thank you so much.